Be a button. There we corner. go. We're Just going. Oh. Hi, um, my name is Renee Capone still. <laughs> and um, I'm currently 5'4 and 140 pounds. I'm telling you this because last time um, I made a video, I, I lied and said I was 5'7. But I've been telling people I've been 5'7 for like a couple years. I didn't know I was 5'4 until just yesterday. The doctor told me and I was shocked. Anyway, so I'm in my apartment and I'm just making a video to show you that I'm alive because I kind of disappear sometimes and that I'm still making art and I'm not a mess. <laughs> and I got a hip hop haircut. So I was going to show you some of the stuff I've been making. Uh, this one is called, a, what is this called? Aquatic Dreams, something like that. And um, yeah, I was really embarrassed when I made it actually, which is kind of cheesy, but I can't be embarrassed about what I make anymore, so I'm just gonna go with it. Um, that's somebody from San Francisco whom I've never actually seen this way. I've only seen pictures of. But I believe it's true. It's not like a Legend of Bigfoot thing. I think this person does probably look like that. Hi, Chris. <laughs> um, this one, I think, is rather lovely. I've had this for a little while now. And, you know, I have trouble remembering the titles because a lot of time other people name paintings for me. So I think I called this Quiet World of Green and Gold, but... Now I can't see why I would do that, so... <laughs> um, oh, these are some of the smaller ones. I mostly just been making 9x12 because it's a good size for me. I'm a small person. I don't need, you know, a lot to work with. I just need something. So I like 9x12. Um, this was from the A Boy Named series from the show I had last year. And this is called A Boy Named Sorrow. And, oh, this one's called Love Through Streaked Glass. I wanted to create almost like looking through stained glass that was streaked. I mean, we know what's going on. It's pretty obvious, right? But I wanted to obscure it and blur it. But people still see what they want. Like, I put this online and people immediately commented it about, you know, oh, look at that. And between these, it's not even remotely there because people are dirty. <laughs> Remember that, people are dirty. Um, but I see I don't just do gay stuff, I do wolves too. Pink wolf. It's a good wolf, right? Mm hmm My friend Dean named this the wolf that guards your dreams. Cool. See, good title, right? Uh, I was gonna call it this long-winded, like, you know, the wolf that stalks you and doesn't eat you, but he was like, no. <laughs> the wolf that guards your dreams. Um, this is a new one, recent. <clears throat> this is Two Crows, kind of a Native American thing, and I was feeling a little violent, so I put blood on it. Not my own blood. Paint. Yeah. Yeah. Red paint. Um, this one's called A Boy Named Sin, because he looks like he's doing something really wrong. Funny thing about that, everybody, <laughs> everybody wants that, but you're not allowed to be sinful. Um, this one I made last week. I think that one's beautiful. This one was um, Morning Mist. It was the idea that everybody wakes up and somehow their body is re reconfigured and everything they think that yesterday is still with them. And I thought that was kind of interesting. It's hot. This one is a boy named Mist. This one I have no excuse for. <sighs> what can I say? Don't get too close. <laughs> <laughs> this one was a boy named Autumn. This one has a boy named Shadow. Mm -hmm. This one is a boy named Stubborn. And um, I made it about my ex-boyfriend, because he was very, very stubborn. Mm -hmm. And, oh, this is a new one. This is the Ice, no. Oh, Spring's Eternal Love Affair with the Ice Princess. It's a very long title. I gotta work on the titles. <laughs> <laughs> I like this one a lot. This is a boy named Persistence. And this one's a boy named Sideways. Oh. 
And this one is something I don't remember. And this is a boy named Stillness. Yes. A lot of boys. I do, I do paint boys. You might say I, I'm known for it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and I still have some other ones that are larger. I don't think I'm going to be doing the large size anymore because I live in a small place and I'm a small person and I need to walk through my apartment and not fall. But I still have some large ones left. Oh, and I still do commissions, actually, yes. So if you got an idea and it's really good, throw it at me and I'll give it a listen and if it's good stuff, we'll do it. Um, this is the latest commission I'm doing about... Um, okay, a lot of people are gonna look at this and say <clears throat> sex. This has nothing to do with sex at all. This is about uh, the spell that these two people cast in order to do what they're going to do. Nothing to do with sex at all. The person who commissioned me to do this was very clear about that. And I, I kind of dug that, but it was a very cool thing to do. So, that's it. Um, my name is still Rene Capone, and I'm still kind of amazing. How was that? <laughs>